<coughs> Good morning. So we have a predicament. The weekend did me real dirty. So what had happened was I, uh, as you know, took two COVID tests last week on Wednesday and Thursday. And both of them turned out negative, which I was like, okay, sweet. Didn't think anything of it. And then <sighs> Friday, Saturday rolled around and your girl just did not feel good. I shouldn't say it didn't feel good because like that makes it sound way worse than it actually was. I just had a headache, like just a very persistent headache. And I was cold, I had chills, which I'm always cold, but like I was especially cold. No sneezing, no coughing, no, no sore throat, except for this morning, my throat's a little itchy. So I've just been in my house, just quarantining myself, not really exposing myself to anyone or anything. So I was like, shoot, okay, let me go get another COVID test. Turns out they didn't have any tests until today. So I'm gonna go get one here in the next like three, four hours. But uh, my weekend was spent inside, just by myself with the dogs really. And granted, I was a little sad because I couldn't be with my boyfriend, but at the same time, it's like, I don't wanna get you sick if I'm sick. I don't wanna get anyone sick, you know? Like being sick sucks, and so I don't wanna pass around any kind of sickness. Even though I didn't have that bad of a sickness and it was just a headache and I felt cold, like somebody else could react completely different and could potentially die, you know? So anyways, I'm gonna get tested today. Even if it's negative, I'm just gonna chill inside for the day because I still feel like I'm kind of on the come up and I just don't feel like going outside either because it's miserable and super cold outside. I feel like I got punched in the freaking noggin. Ugh. Good morning. Oh, yeah. Good morning, my baby. Okay, that guy was unforgiving and he was like, um, excuse me, you can't record. And I'm like, okay, fair, fair enough. I have found myself at the gas station out of necessity, which I'm like, bruh, I don't have any gloves, so I'm about to use like paper towels to touch the pumps and whatnot, because obviously I don't want to get other people sick, but your girl is literally on the E. Like, what am I supposed to do? Thank you, Quick Trip, for fueling me once again. Also, side note, my head is pounding and my eyeballs, my literal eyeballs hurt. That's pretty much it. That and congestion, we're doing pretty good so far. So if I do have COVID, just know that whatever variant I have, 11 out of 10 would recommend. Well guys, since, you know, there's really nothing to do at home and uh, I can't really go anywhere, I decided why not finish some orders. So I've got some orders that need to be sent out before Christmas. And obviously when there's a wood burn order, like I get excited because wood burning is my jam. So thankfully it's kind of warmed up a little bit. It's like, oh, it's probably like 40 degrees now, maybe 45. It's the little things, maybe 45. Dude, straight bumming it. Do I care? No, I don't. Ooh, okay guys, finished product. I love these pieces so much. I can't wait to ship it off. <sighs> That's the stuff. Literally two days later and I am I'm here, I'm alive, I'm well. So this is what happened. Um, <laughs> so last we talked was Monday. I got a COVID test taken and basically just stayed inside all day. Tuesday, AKA yesterday, literally just sat on this couch. That, oh, there's Leroy. Sat on this couch the whole day and um, was waiting for the test results, which never came. And then this morning I wake up and I see that there is a notification saying that my lab results were ready. So let me just indulge you in my results. So let's just view our lab results. There she is. I have COVID. I've had COVID. Um, and I will say, I'll give you a little, ooh, let's maybe not zoom in on my COVID face. Um, I will give you a tiny bit of a synopsis of what I've been feeling. And in that test, it didn't tell me what variant I had. It just said that I had COVID. And so <clears throat> for me, my symptoms were very, very mild. I don't know if I had the Omicron or however you say that variant, I don't know. Um, but all I have is just a lot of congestion and pressure in my head. 
I did feel chills um, a little bit. I would say Sunday and Monday. Now, I don't think I ever actually had a fever. No cough, really. I've been breathing fine. No sneezing. I did have like a little bit of an itchy throat on Saturday, but besides that, like it's just all just congestion and it feels like I just like freaking head butted a brick wall. Like that's just honestly how it feels. Obviously I know that COVID and variants, like it, it all varies based on your age, your pre-existing conditions. Just literally every person is so individual, but um, I've just been drinking water, resting, eating a little bit here and there. Nothing too crazy. I did go outside and I went for a walk yesterday. So that was nice. Getting some fresh air was really good. But besides that, I'm kind of just like here, you know, just chilling. And it sucks because yeah, um, Christmas is basically canceled, which is totally fine. Um, we actually, as a family, are postponing it till later when everybody is clear and we can all get together safely but um yeah i'm gonna have a covid christmas so i can't wait to show you guys what covid christmas looks like for me because i don't even know what it's gonna look like for me i should also say that my parents also have covid and maybe my boyfriend um but i'll keep you updated on if he does or not <sighs> yeah covid came she's here. Thankfully, I'm doing okay. And like, in terms of like symptoms, this is technically like my day four, four to five, because it's kind of hard telling like when you actually got COVID. So I'm hoping it just doesn't get any worse and that I'll just feel better tomorrow or the next day. But if any of you have COVID during Christmas, I am right there with you. So don't feel alone. Um, it definitely sucks, but it's obviously better to stay safe and stay away from people and to take care of yourself before thinking about opening presents or being with your family and all that stuff. So stay safe, stay inside, wear your mask, all the things that people say, because COVID, at least I know right in my area, in the Kansas City area, COVID is rampant right now. Thankfully, I have antibodies now, but still, I mean, it's always better to be safe than sorry. So with that, I'll see you guys in the next video.